It's Mario from SharkandFee.com and today I want to talk about motivation. The reason why I chose this topic specifically for today is because it's one of those days that I really felt like I didn't want to do anything and I didn't want to go to the gym. And I had to go. It was my third leg day of the week. Very important workout. I'm trying to step up my game in gym. I'm really trying to achieve new PRs, really get to new goals. And I must go. And I didn't want to go. So that's like one of the topics that I want to talk about today. And I just want to give you guys my understanding of motivation, how it works. So I imagine motivation as some, something that I can't control. So whatever I can't control, I don't rely on. So motivation is like, I don't know, it depends on how I feel, depends on how the weather is outside, depends on, I don't know, how, what my friends say, depends on what, 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 like, there's millions of things that influence motivation that I can't control and that I don't want to control. So I can't rely on it. I can't trust it to keep me fueled. I can't trust motivation to be a reason for me to do something. That's what I want you to understand. Motivation is an excuse. It's an excuse for people that, that don't want to do things that they have to do. Like, it's very easy to say, okay, I'm not, I don't feel motivated today. I'm not going to do it. I could have said that. I could have easily said that. And, and my mind would have been, okay, it's a perfectly good reason why you didn't go. But does that help me? Does that solve my issue? Like, will I reach my goal? I probably won't. If I keep thinking like that, I probably won't. The, the one other reason is the more you think about, the more you think like that, like the more times you're going to use the same excuse and it's just going to like turn into like, like your primary reason to like go to excuse when you don't want to do shit. So what I want you to do is replace motivation, like remove it from your head and replace it with determination and purpose. And he, here's why. So I've been reading like the biography of Steve Jobs. So it's, it's an amazing book. I recommend, highly, highly recommend you to read it. So there's a thousand pages, like the book is almost a thousand pages. It's very long. But not in a single page of this book does he mention the word motivation. So this is a guy who hustles, this guy who really, really works, like works his fucking ass off. He, he was the CEO of two companies at one point, like Pixar and Apple. He was, he was like really hitting it hard, but not in a single moment, like not in a single like moment of his life did he say like, okay, I'm lacking motivation or, or I have motivation. It, it just, he completely eliminated that and just replaced it with, I have purpose and I'm determined to achieve it. So that, that's, that's his mindset. So I want you to adopt the same mindset when it comes to handling your, your health life, when it comes to going to the gym. The pur purpose obviously is not a single thing. You don't have like one purpose in life. Like th there's impossible to like have just one purpose. You have to have purpose in like different areas where you want to excel as a human being. So like one of those would be getting your health handled. So I want you to think of your getting your health handled as a purpose, as something you have to do. There's no... There's no like not doing it because the consequences are so bad for you and in all the other areas of your life will, will suffer from not getting this handled. So that's like one of the, one of the primary motives that I have, like just, just as, as a person is that I will do, uh, I will stay in my path regardless of how I feel. And that's called determination. That's, that's something that that's a, that's becomes a part of your character. Motivation can't be become a part of your character because it's just too fleeting, you know, it just comes and goes. It just cannot be a character trait because you will never meet someone who says like, okay, I'm motivated 365 days of the year, I'm, I'm fucking like, I'm killing it every single day because that's not possible because we're human and, and humans always will fluctuate up and down, like humans, like our emotions always fluctuate, our life circumstances, they change events happen out of our control and that influences the way how we feel, the way we feel motivated or not. Thus, we cannot rely on that. But if you're a determined person, if you're someone who has a purpose, that's something you can rely on. That's something you can always fall back to and that's always like a source 
of infinite motivation, that source, that source that's gonna fuel you on these shitty days, like the day I had today, was extremely shitty. I didn't wanna like, really didn't wanna do squats or anything because my legs were so sore and tight that I, I couldn't even, like I barely tied my shoes when, when I just walked in the gym for the first time. But I knew I have to do it if I want to reach the next level, if I want to reach my goals, my long-term vision, I have to do it. So there was no, there was no alternative, I had to do it. And that, that's something I just wanna like, like have you guys think about it a little bit and just try to eliminate the word motivation like step by step from your, from your, like, from your life. And just think of it like, think of things like purpose. Be purposeful. Think of things like, like something that, that you have to do because you want to reach like a higher level. You don't want to be in the like lower consciousness relying on, on like being like blown to the left, right, like I, I feel bad, I feel good, I feel like this, I feel like that. It doesn't fucking matter. If you want to do something, if you want to achieve something, you will achieve it. You won't take any excuses. You won't build up excuses. And that's all what I had to say today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, support the video, support the channel by liking and subscribing. And uh, leave a comment below if you enjoyed the video. And uh, peace.